Hi, this is Randy from Fried Eggs Golf, and I'm here today to talk to you about why this is happening to your golf club. When a customer brings in a glove like this to me, the first thing I do is I ask them to show me how they grip the club. And 10 times out of 10, they will show me this grip. With the pinky finger all the way to the end cap there, and what this does is it puts this rubber edge, goes right over that pad in the palm. And the reason these holes start forming is because the majority of our grip pressure is in the trailing edge of that left hand. So when you put that edge right on that pad right there and you start hitting golf shots and you miss hit golf shots, the club's going to twist in your hand a little bit. And that twisting action causes friction and that friction is just going to bore some holes right into the leather. So easy solution to this is you take the club like so and you slide it so the end cap is flush with the back of your hand. Now it looks like you're choking up if you're going off your fingers, but when you flip it from this side, you can see that the butt end of the cap rests you know, pretty squarely to the bottom of the glove. Now, when you do this, when you make impact now, the club twists in your hand, it's, all the pressure isn't in the trailing edge of the palm there, and you're not gonna wear holes and have to buy a glove every single week. Gloves will wear out, it's their nature. But if you can't play a whole season on three, four gloves without tearing a hole in them like this, chances are is you're probably gripping the club like that. So slide it down to the end, should save you some money and a headache of why you're putting so many holes right there in your golf club. So thanks for watching. Uh, if you have any questions, put them in the comment section below. Subscribe to the channel. But until then, I'll see you next time.